Here is Nucida's weekly forecast for the expected post activities in the realm of software quality on social media channels in week 30 of 2025. Our analysis is based on the social media post data from LinkedIn, YouTube, X, and other internet sources released last week, which revealed dynamic daily changes. I'll leverage the provided web results, which cover software quality trends for 2025, and combine them with logical extrapolation of ongoing conversations in the tech community. The ranking is based on the prominence of topics in recent publications, their relevance to current software quality challenges, and their potential for engagement on the mentioned platforms. Each topic's ranking reflects its immediacy, impact, and discussion volume, with reasons for placement and a forecast for future trends included. So, what will be the top 10 hot topics this week? Buckle up and let's start the countdown. 10. Shift Left Testing Reason for Ranking Shift Left Testing, which integrates quality assurance early in the development process, is a steady topic in software quality discussions, particularly in blogs and technical forums. It ranks at number 10 because, while foundational, it's a mature practice with less new buzz compared to emerging trends like AI-driven testing. Recent posts on social media and blogs highlight its importance for reducing defects, but it's overshadowed by flashier topics. The Statista report on automation testing growth in the Asia-Pacific region underscores its relevance, but it's not the most viral topic this week. My advice? To leverage shift-left testing, embed QA engineers in development sprints from day one, use tools like Selenium or Cypress for early automated testing, and foster collaboration between developers and testers via pair programming or code reviews. Prioritize writing testable code and incorporate static analysis tools to catch issues before they escalate. This approach minimizes rework and ensures quality is baked into the product from the start. My forecast for 2025-2026. Shift left testing will remain a staple, but evolve with AI integration, enabling smarter test case generation and defect prediction early in the cycle. By 2026, expect tighter integration with DevOps pipelines, with tools like GitLab and Jenkins incorporating AI-driven shift left capabilities to automate quality checks at the code commit stage. The focus will shift toward predictive analytics to preempt defects, making shift left a proactive rather than reactive strategy. Nine, test automation scalability. Reason for ranking. Test automation scalability is gaining traction in blogs and social media discussions, driven by the need to handle complex, large scale systems. It ranks at number nine because it's a critical but niche concern often discussed in the context of DevOps and CI-CD pipelines. The Mordor Intelligence study cited in automation testing growth indicates a rising demand for scalable solutions, but it's less prominent than broader automation trends. My advice? Invest in modular test automation frameworks like TestNG or Robot Framework to ensure scalability. Design tests to run in parallel across distributed environments using cloud platforms like AWS or Azure for elasticity. Prioritize containerized testing environments, e.g. Docker, to replicate production-like conditions. Regularly review test coverage to eliminate redundancy and optimize execution time. My forecast for 2025-2026, by 2025, test automation scalability will grow in importance as microservices and cloud-native architectures dominate. In 2026, Expect advancements in AI-driven test orchestration, where tools dynamically allocate resources based on test complexity and system load, reducing costs and improving efficiency. Scalability will also tie into sustainability, with a focus on energy-efficient testing frameworks. 8. Performance Testing for Microservices Reason for Ranking Performance testing for microservices is a growing topic in technical blogs and social media, particularly as organizations adopt distributed architectures. It ranks at number eight because it's a specialized area within software quality, with discussions focusing on challenges like inter-service latency and load balancing. While critical, it's less broadly discussed than AI or security topics, as it's specific to modern architectures. My advice? Use tools like JMeter or Gatling to simulate real-world loads on microservices. 
Focus on testing service level agreements, SLAs, for response times and throughput under peak conditions. Implement observability tools like Prometheus or Grafana to monitor performance in real time and identify bottlenecks. Collaborate with architects to ensure microservices are designed with performance testing in mind. My forecast for 2025-2026. Performance testing for microservices will surge in 2025 as more enterprises adopt Kubernetes and serverless architectures. By 2026, AI-powered performance testing tools will predict failure points by analyzing historical data and traffic patterns, reducing manual effort. The trend will also align with chaos engineering, with automated chaos tests becoming standard to ensure resilience in distributed systems. 7. Quality Control Systems Integration Reason for Ranking Quality Control Systems Integration, as noted in blogs like SavvyCom, is a hot topic due to the need for cohesive QA processes across tools and platforms. It ranks at number 7 because it's a practical concern for enterprises, but lacks the viral appeal of AI or cybersecurity. Discussions on social media highlight the need for unified dashboards to track quality metrics, reflecting its relevance, but moderate buzz. My advice? Adopt integrated quality control platforms like Jira or Quality Center that connect with CI-CD tools and test management systems. Standardize metrics, e.g. defect density, test coverage, across teams to ensure consistency. Use APIs to link disparate tools, enabling seamless data flow between development, testing, and monitoring environments. Regularly audit integrations to eliminate silos. My forecast for 2025-2026. By 2025, quality control systems will increasingly leverage AI to automate metric aggregation and reporting, reducing manual overhead. In 2026, expect blockchain-inspired solutions for traceability and quality data, ensuring tamper-proof audit trails across integrated systems. This will be critical for regulated industries like finance and healthcare. Six. Accessibility testing. Reason for ranking. Accessibility testing is gaining momentum in social media and blogs due to increasing regulatory pressure, e.g. ADA compliance, and user demand for inclusive software. It ranks at number six because it's a growing but not yet dominant topic, with social media posts emphasizing its ethical and legal importance. Its rise is tied to social justice trends, as noted in PR discussions. My advice, incorporate accessibility testing tools like Axe or Wave into your QA pipeline to identify issues like missing alt text or poor keyboard navigation. Train developers and testers on WCAG 2.1 guidelines to ensure compliance. Conduct user testing with diverse groups to validate accessibility features. Prioritize automation for repetitive checks while reserving manual testing for complex user flows. My forecast for 2025-2026, accessibility testing will become a top priority in 2025 as regulations tighten globally. By 2026, AI-driven accessibility tools will simulate user interactions for various disabilities, improving test coverage. Expect integration with design tools like Figma to catch accessibility issues during prototyping, making inclusive design a default practice. 5. DevOps-Driven Quality Assurance Reason for Ranking DevOps-Driven QA, combining development and operations for faster delivery, is a major topic in blogs and X, especially with the DevOps market projected to reach $12.85 billion by 2025. It ranks at number 5 due to its widespread adoption and discussion in the context of CI, CD, and automation, though it's less cutting-edge than AI or security. My advice? Embed QA into DevOps pipelines using tools like Jenkins or CircleCI to automate testing at every stage. Define clear quality gates, e.g. code coverage thresholds, to prevent defective code from reaching production. Foster a culture of shared responsibility for quality by training developers in basic testing practices. Monitor pipeline performance to optimize test execution times. My forecast for 2025-2026. In 2025, DevOps-driven QA will integrate more deeply with AI, enabling predictive quality checks based on code patterns. 
By 2026, expect quality ops as a distinct discipline with dedicated roles for managing quality in DevOps workflows. Tools will evolve to provide real-time quality insights, reducing deployment risks in high-velocity environments. Four, cybersecurity and software quality. Reason for ranking. Cybersecurity's role in software quality is a hot topic, with blogs and social media posts highlighting the 3.5 million unfilled cybersecurity jobs projected by 2025. It ranks at number four due to its critical importance in protecting software integrity, though it's slightly less discussed than AI-driven trends. The NASCOM report on cybersecurity job growth underscores its relevance. My advice? Integrate security testing tools like OWASP, ZAP, or Burp Suite into your QA process to identify vulnerabilities early. Conduct regular penetration testing and ensure compliance with standards like GDPR or HIPAA. Train QA teams in secure coding practices and collaborate with cybersecurity experts to align quality and security goals. Prioritize testing for common vulnerabilities like SQL injection or XSS. My forecast for 2025-2026, cybersecurity will remain a top focus in 2025 with AI-driven tools automating vulnerability detection and remediation. By 2026, Expect zero-trust architectures to dominate software quality discussions, requiring QA processes to verify every component's security. Quantum computing may also emerge as a niche topic, posing new challenges for secure software design. Three, user experience, UX, testing, reason for ranking. UX testing is a major focus in blogs and social media, driven by the need for intuitive, user-centric software. It ranks at number three because it's a universal concern across industries, with social media discussions emphasizing its role in customer satisfaction. The focus on storytelling and engagement in social media trends indirectly ties to UX testing's importance in delivering seamless experiences. My advice? Use tools like Usability Hub or Hotjar to gather real user feedback on prototypes and live applications. Conduct A-B testing to optimize UI elements and ensure cross-device compatibility. Involve end users early through beta testing programs to validate UX assumptions. Track metrics like Net Promoter Score, NPS, to quantify user satisfaction and guide improvements. My forecast for 2025-2026. UX testing will grow in 2025, with AI-driven tools analyzing user behavior patterns to suggest design improvements. By 2026, immersive technologies like AR, VR will drive new UX testing paradigms, requiring specialized tools for 3D interfaces. Personalization will also dominate, with QA teams testing hyper-customized user journeys. 2. AI-driven test automation. Reason for ranking. AI-driven test automation is a dominant topic across social media, blogs, and internet sources, fueled by generative AI's impact on content creation and testing efficiency. It ranks at number two due to its transformative potential, with 38% of marketers noting AI's efficiency gains in social media content creation, a parallel to its role in testing. Its prominence is slightly edged out by generative AI's broader applications. My advice, adopt AI-powered testing tools like Testum or Mabel to automate test case generation and maintenance. Use AI to prioritize tests based on code changes and user impact. Ensure human oversight to validate AI-generated test cases, avoiding over-reliance. Invest in training QA teams to work with AI tools, focusing on interpreting AI insights rather than manual test scripting. My forecast for 2025-2026, AI-driven test automation will explode in 2025 with tools predicting defects before they occur using historical data. By 2026, expect self-healing test scripts that adapt to application changes without human intervention. The focus will shift toward ethical AI testing, ensuring algorithms don't introduce biases into quality processes. One, generative AI for software quality reason for ranking. Generative AI tops the list due to its pervasive discussion across social media, blogs, and internet sources, with projections of a $1.3 trillion market by 2032. 
its ability to generate test cases, simulate user behavior, and optimize QA processes makes it the hottest topic in software quality this week. Social media posts and blogs emphasize their role in reducing workload and enhancing efficiency, aligning with broader AI trends in social media. My advice? Leverage generative AI tools like ChatGPT or GitHub Copilot to create test scripts, mock data, and user scenarios. Integrate these tools into CI-CD pipelines to automate repetitive QA tasks. Focus on validating AI outputs to ensure accuracy, as generative models can produce errors. Collaborate with data scientists to fine-tune AI models for domain-specific testing needs. My forecast for 2025-2026. Generative AI will dominate software quality in 2025, with tools generating end-to-end -end test suites from requirements documents. By 2026, expect advancements in AI-driven root cause analysis, pinpointing defects with minimal human effort. Concerns about AI slop, low-quality generated content, will drive adoption of metadata standards like C2PA to ensure test data integrity. Broader forecast for software quality topics in 2025 and 2026. Looking ahead, software quality discussions in 2025 and 2026 will likely center on the following emerging topics. Quantum computing testing. As quantum computing matures, QA teams will need new methodologies to test quantum algorithms, focusing on error rates and coherence times. This will be niche, but gain traction in research-heavy industries. Sustainability in QA. Energy-efficient testing frameworks will emerge, driven by the sustainable tech movement. Tools will optimize resource usage during test execution, aligning with environmental goals, edgerica.co. Ethical AI testing. With AI's growing role, testing for bias, fairness, and transparency will become critical, especially in regulated sectors like healthcare and finance. Immersive technology, QA, AR, VR, and metaverse applications will require new testing frameworks for 3D interactions, spatial audio, and user immersion, driven by platforms like Meta's Metaverse Initiatives, StanVentures.com, Zero Trust Quality Assurance, Security First QA will integrate zero trust principles, requiring continuous verification of every component fueled by cybersecurity demands. These topics will build on current trends, with AI and security remaining dominant, but branching into specialized areas as software complexity grows. Hopefully this video gives you additional insights. What do you think about the hot topics this week? Write your views in the comments section below. In terms of further questions, feel free to write to us. We will analyze all important internet channels and release our analysis report every Monday. Follow or subscribe to this channel to stay up to date and know more than your competitors. Happy testing and see you next time.